Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. India is surrounded by heavily nuclear armed nations driven by authoritarian government. China and Pakistan have extensive military cooperation at various level including weapons of mass destruction which further complicates the national security of India. Now this forces New Delhi towards having a credible nuclear deterrence where nuclear powered ballistic missile submarines or ssbn gives india a robust nuclear deterrence capability unlike the ground based missile system the ssbns are least vulnerable difficult to locate and most survivable deterrence platform ssbns will enable indian navy to maintain continuous at sea deterrence or cast posture Now, India's ATV or Advanced Technology Vessel Project is considered as most secretive and costly defense project till date. Under this, India has planned to build four nuclear ballistic missile submarine called SSBNs, estimated at rupees ninety thousand crore. Each of these submarine will cost upward of four thousand crore rupees. These SSBNs are Arihant S2, Arihat S3, S4, and S4 Star submarines. The construction, commissioning, testing, and status of SSBNs are directly under the Strategic Forces Command (SFC) or Strategic Nuclear Command (SNC), which is under the control of the Prime Minister of India. Now talking about INS Arihant it is India's first indigenous nuclear powered ballistic missile capable submarine in service it is designed based on Akula 1 class submarine of Russia it has displacement of 6000 ton powered by 83 megawatt pressurized water reactor it can achieve a maximum speed of 12 to 15 knots when surfaced and 24 knots when submerged India has developed a range of K family SLBMs or submarine launched ballistic missiles that can be launched from submarines these submarines have four launch tubes where it can carry up to 12 K15 Sagika missile with a range of 750 km or 4 K4 missile with a range of 3500 km on 14th October 2022 the Ministry of Defense had announced the successful launch of nuclear capable submarine launched ballistic missile in bay of bengal with high accuracy from ins arihant the submarine's k15 missile can reach most of the pakistan and its k4 can target all of pakistan if deployed in the bay of bengal k4 can reach up to beijing arihant which is the second and upgraded nuclear power ballistic missile submarine built under the ATV program it was launched quietly in 2017 and is nearing the completion of its sea trial it is expected to enter into service with strategic forces command in the year 2023 the submarine has displacement and weapons carrying capability similar to INS Arihant The next two submarines which are S4 and S4 class submarines will be an upgraded version with higher displacement of around 7000 ton. The S4 and subsequent boats are labeled as Arihant stretch variants having eight launch tubes. It can carry 24 K15 SLBM or 8 K4 SLBM almost double in terms of firepower when compared with Arihant. The third of the Arhant class SSBN uh, which is code named as S4 was quietly launched sometime in the last week of November 2021 in Visakhapatnam. The soft launch of S4 was first reported by UK based Jane's Defence Weekly. In order to maintain the continuous at sea deterrence or cast posture and to have credible and reliable second strike capability indian navy needs minimum 4 ssbn this will ensure the permanent deployment of ssbn on eastern and western seaboard 
and uninterrupted deterrence patrol while one or two SSBNs are undergoing maintenance. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.